Our favorites is in the kitchen. Aquila Stanbeck, how are you doing? I am well, Sheldon. Thank you. How you are know, you? So we hear sweater weather. Mm -hmm. Well, I call it soup season for me when it gets cold like this. Yes. And we've got a way to keep people warm, do we not? Absolutely. We've got a great butternut squash soup today. Mm -hmm. And it's very versatile because you can add butternut squash. You can add sweet potato. You can add, it has some greens in it. You can add some greens. I'm going to add just a little oil. Okay. That may have been a lot of oil, but I'll add some oil. And then we'll add celery and onions. Mm-hmm. So you're, uh, by like the way, I'm looking at this, you're saying cook some of your things first before you add the water and stuff? Yeah, before you add the broth. Just kind of, just so your vegetables can saute a little okay. bit. Um, that'll help, you know, just soften them up because sometimes, you know, you don't want crunchy onions. Okay, in this. yeah. You know, you just want it to soften up a little bit. So we'll just saute those a little bit. I'll add uh, garlic. Mm-hmm everything's better with a little garlic so that's fresh garlic you can use garlic powder mm -hmm. if you want or you can use um, the garlic now they have garlic in a tube now did you know that uh, they've got everything and everything in a yeah. tube and I noticed you've got the heat on like a little medium there you don't right. want to cook too fast exactly or just like want that. it to kind of simmer mm -hmm. um, and it's soup and it's not going to take long for everything to kind of come together mm -hmm. so we've got a little salt and pepper you're doing a little pinch there but it's yeah. it's whatever your taste it's wants, whatever right? you want I, you know I typically use a lot of pepper because right. I like pepper so, yeah but it's whatever you want so we're just you know sauteing it just like I said to soften it up a little bit mm -hmm. and then I am going to add a little sprig of rosemary what does that do just adds a little extra flavor you can add rosemary you can add thyme okay. um, or you can leave it out altogether. it's soup so okay. you know you add what your family you likes you want, yeah. yeah we're about a minute and a half away so so yeah are we good? so we're mm -hmm. good there well um, you have your butternut squash so we'll right. just add we're just gonna add everything in now mm -hmm. so we've got butternut you got squash. that out of a bag but you can do yeah. what you can you do want, fresh right? or frozen okay. yep. so we've got white beans we're adding the white beans you can and add any kind of beans that you want or? any kind of beans okay. you want if you like uh, kidney beans and you want to do a different type of soup you can add meat mm -hmm. this is just um, broth you don't have to you know spend hours in the kitchen like right. your grandmother may have you can just add a little broth here uh -huh. so I heard you say you can add meat you can add basically anything in there that's similar absolutely if you want some turkey sausage ham whatever absolutely uh -huh. and then this is one that's already ready we're just I'll put it in the bowl so people can kind of see what it looks like is it best to cover a soup when you want to cook just to let it sit or just to kind of let it sit and simmer yeah okay. I would definitely stir it a little bit you don't have to stir it frequently uh -huh. so we're just gonna put a little in the bowl you can about 30 see seconds out, a little yeah. time uh-huh there we go very nice so how long did you have it on the uh, top right there before? um about 20 minutes okay and then we'll put it here uh -huh. we'll add a little swiss chard you can mm. add whatever kind of greens you want mm -hmm. and you can actually if you want to do a collard green or a kale a heartier green you can put it in a soup and let it but I it like just that. needs to wilt a little bit and this is swiss chard so it won't take long right. to wilt and a good sandwich can go along with this if absolutely you, you can do a grilled cheese you can do a turkey sandwich whatever kind of sandwich Real your quickly, family likes lily's tea you've got a tea coming up right? i have a tea coming up on sunday november 6th and afternoon tea at Arlington House. Arlington House also has a garden so you can pick a few vegetables while you're oh, there. Great. They welcome people to come. It's a community garden. And where's Arlington House located? Arlington House is in West End. I'm just and out of the just, bowl. Come okay, on, whatever. Right. Don't you do that? I do, but I'm only at home, not on TV. I can do that on TV. <laughs> this is where I do it. So, yeah. Mm. Oh, that's nice. Oh, I can taste the pepper too. Yes. That is perfect. It's exactly the way I like it. I like a little kick to everything, so mm -hmm. that's great. Awesome. Mm. Aquila Stanback, Thank Lily's you. Cup. Thank you. Did so I get much. that right? Yes, you got okay. it right. Yeah. Fantastic. Cup. You know it. I love this butternut squash soup. Sounds perfect for me. Thank well, we've you. got plenty more still to come.